Oke, okay. mulai podcast with Rocky. Pedil. Oke, okay, MJ. So what you been up to, man? I know uh, this this thing is crazy. Everybody staying home. I I saw that you still shooting around though. So what you been up to? So I I've, I've, I've been trying to stay active physically because I need to, you know, stay stay fit, especially if I want to go play college basketball. Um I've just been lifting, trying to get bigger, trying to get stronger, trying to incre- try to try to increase my hops, trying to get bigger so I can play better defense and stuff like that. Um obviously another important thing that that I've been doing is uh recruiting. So I'm I've been trying to talk to a lot of coaches lately. So any thing you can share about that with us or not yet? Yeah, I have two offers. Okay, oh, you got two offers. That's nice. From yeah. Division 2? Uh, D2 and D2 and AIA, D2 uh, D3 and CWA. Okay, that's nice. I know it's uh this is a sad time for you also because I know you still had six more months probably at Impact. It was supposed to be like uh, four or five. Yeah, it was supposed to be from January to like May. I know you're supposed to fly back to the US I think last month. Yeah, pas habis kejuaraan as langsung harusnya uh-huh. balik. Kan kita selesainya hari hari Minggu. Senennya harusnya gue itu balik. So how how is this gonna affect your journey on playing college basketball in the states? Um, to be honest, sih, kalau you know how basketball season kan, ada ada seasonnya kan di Amerika. Mm-hmm. Yeah, it it ends basketball season kalau gue nggak salah it ends in March. Yes. So and this whole thing impact tim tim yang anak-anak di Sangkatan gue tuh mereka disuruh pulang mm. pas end of March, around middle of March. Okay. So, so sebenarnya sih it was pas banget like when uh it was pas banget on on time where everyone just had to leave. Karena 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 my coach si David Amara, lu kenal David kan? Iya yeah, iya, yeah, I know David. So David told uh, all my international friends suruh pulang kayak yang dari mm. Australia, Europe semuanya suruh pu- suruh pulang. Okay. Nah, Dia bila, terus gue cerita, cerita ke dia, ke dia tentang uh, masalahnya kita di sini kan ya udah terus he said it's fine as long as you get your recruiting done which is why gue bikin YouTube YouTube videos gitu gitu okay. uh, such as like my highlight clips pas gue di sini highlights pas gue di US I already have enough footage for me to make a highlight reel it's, it's decent enough okay. penting kayak udah kelihatan lah gue lawannya siapa pasti karena kan udah orang-orang tahu kok gue lawan lawan sekolah sekolah besar kayak Hillcrest sama Wasatch gitu gitu kan mm. so so buat gue sih I have I have enough footage from uh for coaches to see and I just need to start talking to more coaches because uh, yang yang offersnya gue dua itu uh, sebenarnya sih uh, it's not it's not something that I would uh, I have a high chance of taking because mm-hmm. one one it's it, I mean it's close to family tapi it's not in California okay. I prefer going to California really close to family kan dua um, masalahnya itu tentang majornya gue. Gue kan mau ambil film, tapi dua sekolahnya okay. gak ada. So though, that's that's pretty much the two big reasons why I don't know if I'm gonna be able to take these two schools. Damn, nah, that means you have to look for more dong. Harus cari yang ada major yeah. filmnya dong berarti. Yeah, so I've been I've been talking to David and uh, he's gonna help me find some schools in Cali. Apakah ada option? Apakah sudah ada option untuk sekol- nama sekolahnya untuk yang ada major film? I don't see I think there's three schools that I'm looking at right now. Um I think the top of the list namanya Chapman University is D3 uh NCAA very okay. good very 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 good film program and a decent basketball team okay. so that's one. Uh, another one is UC Santa Cruz uh University of California Santa Cruz Division 3 as well has a film program and uh, mm. the, the next one is a uh, a small school in uh, a small school near San Jose namanya Pacific Union College okay. and it's for your college can um Terus uh, ada ada film ada film programnya NIA Division Two. That's good enough sih for me. I mean, I, I, if I can get one of those schools, I'll be super happy. Karena I can I can check off one of my dreams of playing college basketball in the US and um, bisa you know study and get a you know financial help from the school for me to study for free. You know? Man, we are all, we are all mendoain lu lah. Kita semua doain lu lah bisa balik lagi ke Amerika and Nothing. continue your school and also your basketball career over there. We want to see you play college basketball too, but uh, ini kan impact batal nih kan misalnya ke lu nggak jadi main di sana empat sampai lima bulan lagi. Padahal nih di, di boleh dibilang di second half of the season lah of impact right? 
Ya, yeah, the second half of the season. Ada enggak sih lawan-lawan yang jago and lu udah look forward to play against tapi enggak jadi main gara-gara ini? Prolific prep. Who they got? Jalen Green. Oh, they got Jalen Green? Wow, okay. That's probably gonna be the number one pick in like two years, right? I was supposed to go harusnya tadi mau lawan mereka cuy. It's just that this whole thing happened. We were supposed to play against them end of March and we were supposed to uh-huh. have a game at their home. I was supposed to play wow. after Olympic prep, tapi nggak jadi. So I couldn't. It's not. I I couldn't do anything about it. You know, I wanted to go back and play. I was already so. I'm. I was so ready to go back home. I wanted to like. Ever since gue kalah final ke Jurnas, gue pengen banget mm-hmm. rock kayak. Gue pengen banget bukan. I don't want to prove to people. Mm-hmm. I don't need to prove to them. I need to prove to players in the yeah. states, man. I need. To, I need to show good enough to play. Which is why gue tadi. Gue bener-bener bete, sedih, depresi karena gue gak bisa pulang. Hmm. Because you know I miss so much practice, I miss eh. school, everything like that. Eh, kayak mana? Tapi padahal tuh, it's gonna look good on your resume if you play against them. Then because you could, you play against Hillcrest already too. Yeah, I played Hillcrest twice. <laughs> Makanya itu sayang banget sih. But yeah. okay, that's your. U.S. basketball journey. Let's talk about something more personal di Indonesia. Okay. Uh, first of all, kan banyak anak muda nih pasti yang bisa uh, relate ke lu ya. Karena kan mm-hmm. di basket itu pasti ada halnya disappointment, right? Like just like you what you just said, lo disappoint juga nggak bisa balik ke Amerika karena ini lo nggak bisa nyesel. I can't hear you. I can't hear you. Ah, oh, damn. Okay, thank you, Mina. You're lagging. I'm moving. Okay, I'm lagging. Okay. No, I want to ask you about uh, basketball. Basketball in Indo- about your Indonesian basketball. Okay. What's up? Can you hear me now? Yeah, yeah I got you. Okay. Uh, gue mau nanya aja kan. Gue gue yakin banyak banget anak-anak muda di sini yang bisa relate sama lu juga lah. Yeah. yeah. Uh, in basketball, banyak sekali disappointment, rejection. Lo tau lah itu kan pasti. And you deal with two disappointment in a very short month. Lo kalah di kejurnas di final, and then you cannot go back to impact. How do you deal and bounce back from this situation? I mean, when um, pas gua kalah final sih, that was heartbreaking mm. because one, I really wanted to like, I I was super motivated to like mm. beat Marcel because he kicked our first game, and we, <laughs> I, in my honest opinion, those guys. Completely took me out. I mean, like, have, did you see their defense on me? They box yeah. man with three guys, bro. I mean, I can't do anything about it. You know, if I'm getting picked and I get free and someone else boxes boxes me, I can't do anything about it. I mean, those guys were just uh-huh. a really good team. Those guys, they were a good team together. They worked together, especially their defense. So I couldn't do anything about it. Right? I mean, I mean, I I feel like if they loosened up their defense, I probably I could have had dropped like I probably could have dropped like twenty on them or something. At least get a, mm-hmm. a good enough. You know, I was very confident playing that game. It's just that I was super heartbroken and depressed when we lost. And on top of that, I was supposed to leave back to America the next day, but then this whole this shit just started, you know, blowing up, and yeah. I couldn't do anything about it too. I mean, how I handled it was, I mean, I I I didn't play basketball for a week on purpose because buka, ya gimana ya? Bukan malas sih, tapi gue emang pengen. Yeah. Berhenti aja dulu, reset, you know. Karena biasanya kalau lu nggak main basket tuh beberapa hari, pasti lu pengen lagi reset, main lagi. Betul. Kan? Yeah, like everyone right now. Tapi kayak um, pas gue gitu, um, then I started just shooting around my house, trying to get my shot better. Because ever since I came back from the states, I was shooting a lot better. I was shooting probably 50% from the three, and I was trying to you know make more shots and stuff like that. Because I needed to you know, I needed to be able to fix the mistakes I did. So pas gue di kan pas gue gue di kejurnas gue emang nggak handle bolanya terlalu banyak karena kan gue point guardnya banyak banyak juga di tim gue, mm. so gue have to like work on my handles more and on top of that I need to start working harder in the gym because ya yeah, gue harus gedein badan gue harus kuatin badan gue biar karena kan kalau lu tahu orang-orang di Amerika tuh kayak gede-gede kuat gitu-gitu kan so it's like I need to be yeah. able to I need to be able to compete against guys there not here because Because I've already been competing against guys that were in America already, and I can't lower my standards. You know, okay? It's mm. not. I'm not. I'm not saying that Indonesia has bad standards. No, it's not. They don't. It's not. Um, it's not that they don't have bad standards. It's just that the U.S. is completely advanced. With of course, like, not. It's different. Can I compare it, man? <laughs> yeah, 
exactly. So I can't I can't lower my standards to where I want to play. Mm. You know, makanya go kaya. I was super 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 motivated at home. That's why I've been lifting so much lately. I've been trying to I've been trying to play as much as I can, even though it's hard because I can't play five on five. Yes, anya kan kalau lo mau jadi tambah bagus harus five on five gitu kan. Nah, betul. Yeah, terus gue kan I've just been trying to pra- practice as much as I can, especially working on my you know working on my mental ability, be stronger. Gitu gitu aja sih gue. Like I'm, I'm, I'm just trying to, you know, become a better person. You know, that's it. I'm just trying to jadi, be a better person. Jadi, But, jadi those two disappointment motivate you a lot. Yeah, motivated me a lot. I mean, I don't want to lose, bro. I mean, I don't think mm. anyone. Wanna, I don't want. Any, I don't think anyone want to take L's, man. Especially with Marcel, bro. Yeah, that's true. Especially with Marcel, and you know that idiot, man. <laughs> <laughs> But Marcel don't. Dia ngerti nggak bahasa Inggris. <laughs> It's different. <laughs> yeah, bahasa Inggrisnya dia salah. <laughs> I think, but I feel actually, like, I feel what he thinks mm-hmm. in his head sounds correct, but when he says it out loud, it's not. You know, that's probably what happens. <laughs> but but actually, and lo, Marcel, he's my best friend. He's my best friend, man. He's one of my closest friends. I've been with him for a long. Mm-hmm. Uh, we've been homies for such a long time. I I don't know what I'd do without him, man. He's 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 such a good friend of mine. Especially pas makanya gue pas final pengen I was so motivated to beat him, man, because I wanted to beat him. I've never I've never beaten him before. We played on the same oh, team. Really? Before kejurnas u 16 gue kalah lawan jatim sebelas uh, point and padahal we were we were tied until the last quarter. Wow. Terus terus kemarin kejurnas juga kalah kan ya gue nya mau 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 ke mana gue gak bisa apa apa. I mean if I can then, be a lo kalau lo main lawan Marcel gitu sehari sebelumnya ngobrol dulu masih mana? Iya lah lo tau Marcel kayak gimana pasti ngobrol sama lo. <laughs> dia dia tas lock gitu nggak sih malu? Ngomongnya ngacau-ngacau semua. <laughs> What did he say? He said gonna drop 30 on you? No, he said he was gonna he was gonna take my dad's money or something. <laughs> <laughs> He's like, I'm gonna be after after I after I beat you, I'm gonna have a date with Chelsea Islan. And I was like, what, bro? <laughs> <laughs> Emang Chelsea Islan mau diajak date sama Marcel? Ah, <laughs> Marcel aja gak bisa ca- dapet cewek biasa aja. <laughs> Imagine the artist, wow, Marcel. Bro. Wow, I think what's life I give Marcel again. You better, bro. That's funny. I'm gonna watch that. Yeah. You better tell. I'll, I'll ask him later. Mike, talk. thank you so much though. Thank you so much for your time though, man. Appreciate it. No problem, no problem. Hopefully, Good talk, semoga dude. interview ini bermanfaat untuk banyak orang, apalagi pemain-pemain muda. Because I wanna, you know, uh, help how young players deal with failures or with disappointment, you know. Because it happens in basketball, you know. Jangan sampai orang nyerah aja. Yeah. <laughs> Shout out to Sanggu, man. <laughs> Michael James. Shout out to him. I kept sniping him. Yeah, what about the real tournament, Sang? <laughs> what Where's Sang from? I didn't do a single three. <laughs> uh-huh. <laughs> Shout out to my boy Sanggu, man. He's my homie. Shout out to Ashley. Where, where are you from? Him. He's from Jizz. <laughs> oh, he's from Jizz, okay. Yeah. Adriel, wah Adriel boleh kalau live nih, kalau malah Adriel malah kalau Adriel dia seru. Gue gue nonton, gue nonton juga sih itu gue bakal ngakak sih. Pasti ngakak. MJ, thank you man, take care bro. Hopefully we can Bye. see you see each up. other very soon man. Yeah, see you. We'll play. Thank we'll you for everybody watching man. Peace out man.